What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Carm. I'm here with... Darnell, Speedy Artist, a.k.a. 3, a.k.a. The Logo. A.k.a. The Logo. <laughs> Darnell, we're here in your spot. Yeah. Why did you want to start this? Yeah. So, I'm from right here in East Germantown, Atlanta Young. And I used to, you know, grow up. I played all over the city. I played in North, South Philly. I played in the programs and all that. So, I just wanted to have a league of my own in my own backyard. Started off something small, but I had a vision. I had a plan. And I've been executing it. How is it to see the outpouring of people that come out here? Like, I've seen the videos on Instagram before yeah. I came out here. And there is always a packed house. How do you get them out here, number one? Number two, how do you feel seeing all these people out here? Well, first, how we get them out here, like, you know, between me and my network, my team, you know, Shakur, YR, Juice, Sheen, Reek. You know, we got a wide range of people that mm -hmm. we all know. So, like, we had Wack out here. You know, Core, I grew up with Core and... You know, he grew up from around here a little bit. And like a Philly connection. The Philly connection. Uh -huh. Started off just doing something for our hood. And then we're doing it for the whole city. Yeah. Uh, we, we say we're the best arena in the world. Mm -hmm. And it's something that I really stand firm on. Uh, All the games I saw were super competitive. They yeah. were playing defense. They were playing really hard. Like they were talking. Like, how do you think players bring that here? I think that the same way I feel about being able to play in our city, it's just something different. You get a chance to come out here and play in front of some packed crowd. Yeah. They want to perform. They want to, you know, represent themselves well, represent their family well their friends and then you got people from other hoods talking mm -hmm. trash mm -hmm. and it just adds mm -hmm. to the energy yeah and then at the end of the night like i said it's all love it, it's just beautiful the beautiful thing yeah what does this mean to the community to bring all these players to all these different places here well it's cool. look, it's <laughs> right it now, right? so obviously basketball is just a stage is just something that you know we set to be able to make a deeper impact you know i do want people to see that this is the hood and we can have something like this all love no issue no drama but then, you know, like in November, we gave away 100 turkeys, mm -hmm. you know, make the community that we grew up in better so that the youngest coming up behind us can do what we do in times 10. So yeah. just showing them the blueprint, something that we didn't really have a blueprint for, you feel me? You could give me like three words to describe or like if you want people to think of these words and think of your league, <laughs> what you do, what would those words be? Uh, competitive, um, camaraderie, and just it's peaceful. Like it's just it's peace of mind. People come out here on Monday and Wednesday for sure. You can have the craziest weekend, but when Monday get here, at least you know you're going to get to go to the best arena right. in the world, enjoy some good basketball, laugh with some mm -hmm. people on the sideline, get some good food. Everybody going to you know, know that I was a good basketball player, but this is what they're going to remember. They're going right. to remember how me and my friends just decided that we're going to bring our community together first, and then it's going to help bring our city together, mm -hmm. and we're going to just continue to put ourselves on the front line and continue to make impacts way deeper than basketball. Basketball right. is just the fun. You feel right, me? right. Basketball is just kind of like the connecting point, but yeah, it's not the bigger picture. Exactly. And Shout out to Sokarm coming to the best arena in the hey. world.